Up the middle, and there's his first big league hit. Even Joey Votto said, Congratulations, kid. He gets his first major league hit, a ringing single right back up the middle. And the authenticator will authenticate. Yes. That's what he does best. <laughs> Swing and a high fly ball belted. First home run for Acuna as a tape measure shot in Cincinnati. Wow. An absolute missile into the second deck, and it's 2 0. Breaking ball hammered and into the left center field gap. Freeman will score. Acuna chugging for two. He'll slide in safely. It's three to nothing, Atlanta. So now this one's hit toward left. Acuna on the run. Diving catch. Fly ball hammered toward left center field. Herrera back. That is off the wall. It ricochets away from him. One run is in. He stumbles around the bag. A sniper got him. He'll have to head back to the base. And the ball dropped by Kingery. He smokes this down by the pole left field, and this game is tied at one. His 14th, then he'll be standing at the top of the order for a while, it looks like. Two one pitch. Swing and a drive. That's launched. That ball is gone. Home run ball allowed by Anderson. Two out magic for Atlanta and the Braves are back in front. nicknamed Wikipedia by his teammates as this one's whacked toward right center field and deep. Sierra back and it's into the back and another leadoff homer for Acuna. He's something. That's his third leadoff home run, Joe. Tell you that was a good at bat too. 22-year-old right-hander Mirandy Gonzalez and a rope hit to deep center on the first pitch. Can you believe it? My goodness. <laughs> and Gabe Joe just looked at each other and I had no idea what to say. It's Tim Palmer out of the leadoff spot. A homer in four consecutive games. That Double header with home runs. He's homered in four straight games. First pitch. Hit hard. Left field. Deep. Might go. Gone. He did it again. Seventh home run in his last eight games. He has homered in five consecutive games. He was the youngest player in the history of baseball to do it in four consecutive games. And I don't know about you, fellas. I got goosebumps on that one. They're not wall scrapers either, boy. Mr. Richards and Homer. And this one's driven to right. That ball's deep. That ball is gone! Years old. Hit high in the air to right field. This one drifting back. This one at the wall. Judge is there. Leaps into the air. And he could not bring it back. That's a home run by Ronald Acuna. Bombs away here in the Bronx, and the Braves lead it five to three. And even the six foot seven right fielder, Aaron Judge, couldn't bring that back. And the Braves now lead for the first time in a long time. It's five three. Really expanded his strike zone. A shot of base hit, a missile to left, and Atlanta's in front. The newest baby brave 
Braves come through. And snaps off a breaking pitch to get Perello for the first out of the night. It's a soft bouncing ball to second. That's Rostin Barnes is playing tonight. Two up and two down for Bueller. Fastball blown by him. And Walker Bueller with his best first inning. He's in the top six in the big leagues already. Uses 98 to get Lopez for his third K. Another 0-2. This one in the corner for strike three. Galvis pops it into center field. Let's see if Tim LoCastro can find it. He does. It's in his second full big league season. Down on strikes with a sharp breaking pitch. Pokes one to third. That's Farmer. That's two. Waits on this one two from Bueller. And yanks it to deep left field, sending Verdugo back. Able to make the catch one away. Bueller strikes him out with a fastball. And two away in this fourth. Yanked to right field. Matt Kemp is going to put it away. That does it for the Padres in the fourth. Here's Fernando with Pepe and Iguez on the Spanish television broadcast. On the first pitch, Matt Caesar bounces out to Walker Bueller for the first out of the fifth. Swung on and missed strike three. Galvis is down on strikes. Nice stop at third by Kyle Farmer. And five no-hit innings for Walker Bueller tonight to the sixth. He strikes out Garrett to open the sixth. His eighth K. And it's bounced gently left side. At short, Chris Taylor throws him out to gone. He knew the rule better than I did. Here's Hosmer with a roller to short. Chris Taylor's got it. 92 pitches and six no-hit innings. 93 pitches now. The 2-2. He struck him out. The Dodgers have thrown a combined no-hitter. Monterey, Mexico can throw its sombrero to the sky. Four brilliant pitchers on the mound tonight. Bueller, Singrani, Jimmy Garcia, and Libertor. Two balls and two strikes. Popped up. The shift was on, so a long way to go to make this catch. And it's put away by Grandal. And he struck him out. 32 pitch now to Harrison Bader with Molina on deck. And he strikes out. And that's number three tonight for Bueller. He's two there with. The Flaherty's of the world. That's impressive. Tapped out in front of the plate by Carpenter. Grandal, a smart play to pick it up before it rolled foul. Good, really a good play. The next two, Adams. And the shallow right. And the catch is made. Molina. Oh boy, that was a hanging breaking ball, and Turner comes up with it. The one two pitch to Wisdom. Got him. That's now six strikeouts for Bueller. Fastball got him. And Carpenter struck out twice, and both times words with the home plate umpire. 0 2 pitch. And he struck him out. And I'm reaching and another fly ball to Cody Bellinger and the Cardinals will go quietly one two three. Carpenter a strikeout. Cardinals strand a pair. It's two nothing. Just stadium on their feet. Brown ball slowly hit the short. Machado's got it. He'll throw to first. And that will end the inning. Coming up to hit. In the year Machado shading his eyes just onto the grass. He's been sensational today. Down on strikes, third strikeout of the game for Bueller. The Mayhew who's over to a fly out and a ground. The middle, T.K. Hernandez off balance. What a play! What a play by T.K. Hernandez! Wow! Here we go. The youngster has a chance to do some damage in his first start. Soto, long ball to left. See you later. First pitch. First homer, first RBIs. A three-run homer to the opposite field and left center for 19-year-old Juan Soto. A tremendous three-run homer for his first hit in the major leagues. 400.
222 feet. Bang! Zoom! Go Soto! Soto turns on one, high in the air, right field. See you later. Three for three day, second big league homer, tie game. High in the air, slicing away from Gardner, and see you later. Another opposite field, extra base hit for Soto. And it's a three-run homer. Soto, right center. See you later. Got to be one of the longest homers at Yankee Stadium this year. And the kids got a couple. The Nats lead five to four. Oh, my. Look at this. See you later the second deck up on the concourse and the teenager visits a part of the ballpark that maybe Bryce Harper and Adam Dunn have unbelievable Juan Soto homers in a game that started on May 15th on June the 18th is it his first home run or his sixth swinging a long drive down the right field line this is way back and it's a line drive home run for Soto in and out of the seats down the right field line. The Nationals' second solo homer of the inning is Juan Soto's 12th. It's now Miami 3 and the Nationals 2. 49 walks to 49 strikeouts. And a swing and a fly ball hit to deep left. This is way back. This is going, going, and gone goodbye. An opposite field home run again off a left-handed pitcher for Juan Soto. Landing that one into section 104 in left field. Not much doubt about that one on an 0-2 pitch from Newcomb. Soto swings and drives one deep down the left field line toward the corner. If this one's fair, it's gone. It's way back there, and it is gone. Just inside the foul pole down the left field line, Juan Soto hits one out to left field on a 3-0 pitch from Jake Arrieta. And hit a two-run homer in the fourth inning is 17th. Swing and a high drive, deep left center field. Herrera back to the warning track, to the wall. There it goes. Second of the night, a four RBI game. The Nats are back on top. Soto to right. See you later. Carlos Gonzalez didn't move. And for Soto, it's number 22. RBI number 69. He ties Bryce Harper on the all-time teenage home run list. And the Nats do get out of slam range. It's 6-1. to one.